Hello my amazing sexy mofos, this is your boy Venomy here, I really do hope you're all okay and having an amazing day so far. In today's video I am back with another Fallout 76 video, and in today's video I'm going to be showing every single one of you essentially how to have the perfect camp, how to merge any item onto nearly anything the possibilities are endless with this you can have so much fun with this but before we start if you are new around here and like what you see then please do subscribe to join this amazing sexy family but now let's jump straight into this okay first of all i want to give a shout out to tng for this because this is going to change camps everywhere Honestly, I am so, so excited actually to see what you all can come up with. Um, I know for a fact when I do my vendor hopping for now on, I'm going to be seeing a lot more amazing camps. And I honestly cannot wait. So this is super easy to do. You just need the advanced power connector plan, which you can get many, many locations and many, many vendors all over the map. It's the pressure plate that comes with the plan. So you want to place that on the floor. Now, you want to pick something that you actually want to merge the items onto. Like a desk, or a pool table, or a shelf. It works with almost anything. So that's why I say the possibilities are endless. Next, from the, this season, if you have unlocked it, the chessboard. The chessboard display. You want to put as many of these wherever you're putting them, if it's on a counter in your kitchen for a bread box for example, or it's endless honestly, just use your imagination. So I've got my stash box which is this desk, and I've put the chessboard displays on top. Now I'm just going to select a few random items that I expect I will see scattered around some people's camps, you got a bread box that you would have in your kitchen. You could have jarred scorch if you wanted to, um, masks, displayable items, drinks, uh, bullets, it's entirely up to you. I just put a, some cleaning products, a bread box, a scorch head and a blasting cap box for the sake of argument. It is super super easy to do. So you just want to have them displayed however you want, just picture the chessboard isn't there. Now after this what you want to do is clip the stash box onto the pressure plate now I'm gonna place it down just so I can give you guys a bit of a better example you're gonna see the stash box when you clip it onto the, the pressure plate you're gonna see the stash box slightly lift up in the air you'll see it any second now see how it levitates now when it starts levitating put the stash box down and stand on the pressure plate. From here, select your stash box and then put it down, then select it again and put it down again. You want to just do that two to three times and you'll see the chess boards will lower and lower and lower, but the actual items on the display will stay in the same location. After that, the chess boards sink into the actual stash box. So they're still there, but they're not visible, but the items that you want on display will stay there. After that, you can remove the pressure plate, get rid of it, store it, scrap it, and then you are done. Unless you want to obviously start merging more items, you can do it with book bookcases, bookshelves. This for example, this cabinet, every single shelf on this cabinet, so I could put a chessboard on the bottom shelf, the middle shelf and the top shelf, place some items on there and I can merge it. Now granted, it sometimes messes up depending on what display you actually use and what item you're actually using. Now by mess up, I don't mean it's not going to merge. It will merge every time and it will look insane. But sometimes, depending on the actual cabinet you're using, underneath the shelf sometimes the chessboard sticks out so obviously the way to counteract that 
instead of placing it down twice, just place it down once. So then the chessboard is directly inside the shelf instead of below the shelf so the actual display item is sitting on the shelf. It's You'll see what I mean in a second. So I've got the items however I want them, turn this teddy bear around, grab the cabinet, once again you just want to clip it on to the pressure plate just to when it levitates and when it's levitating put it down, stand on the pressure plate, pick the cabinet back up put it down, select it again, and then put it down one last time. As you see, the items have merged into the shelf. Looks amazing, but this is what I mean. Instead of putting it down twice, just put it down once if it's this type of cabinet. And then the chessboard won't be underneath that shelf. It will actually be directly inside the shelf. So you won't see the chessboard at all, but your items will still be on display. And that's what I mean, you can do it with absolutely anything. The possibilities with this are endless. I cannot wait to see what you guys can do with this. But I'm going to wrap this video up here. I really do hope you're all okay and having an amazing day so far. If you have enjoyed this video at all, then please do drop a like on it, it really does help me out a lot. And if you are new around here, please do subscribe to join this amazing sexy family. But I love every single one of you, and I'll see you all in the next video.